Moving on, in another case of violence instigated by a rumor, two people were beaten to death and two were injured by a mob on suspicion of being child lifters in Sabroom in South Tripura district. Now, these two deceased were from UP and they had come to sell utensils in Buramuri district. And since the incident took place, internet services in Tripura have been banned to stop the spread of viral videos and messages. Arindam Das now joining us on the phone line. Arindam, this is an extremely disturbing trend where on the basis of unverified rumours, social media messages, people are being beaten up to death. Yet another case coming to light from Tripura this time. Yes, mob lynching continues unabated uh, across India. This time it has taken place in Tripura where uh, two separate incidents of mob lynching claimed the lives of two people while two were grievously injured. The first incident happened in West Tripura district where a group of uh, vendors uh, uh, went there to sell utensils that they belong from Uttar Pradesh and uh, the, the mob had gathered around them. Uh, the mob was around 1,000 people who gathered uh, around them and then were uh, beat, they tried uh, beating them. Uh, in fact, one of the uh, vendors uh, lost his life uh, on the spot while two others were grievously injured. He was uh, she. Uh, they were shifted to hospital for treatment. Uh, the other incident happened in South Tripura district, uh, where a uh, government then government uh, driver went to, uh, on an awareness campaign to spread the message that uh, uh, rumors are doing the rounds that uh, child lifters are on the prowl in the state. So people should not be misled by such fake news. So that driver was also attacked by a mob of around thousand people. He also lost his life. Uh, following this incident, uh, uh, security right. has been heightened across the state. In fact, internet services has been totally suspended to st uh, stop the spread of rumors and hate messages. But these are not isolated incidents, Sarindam. We know these such uh, similar incidents are being reported from across the country. What is what is the administration doing to check these rumors? Because uh, there needs to be, a, you know, a, a full a full on effort there to check uh, the, the kind of trend is, uh, is emerging and this is not isolated to the northeast but uh, these incidents are coming in from across the country knee-jerk reactions such as uh, suspending internet services is not the answer uh, to such a trend is there a concerted effort here to check uh, you know to check the spread of these false rumors these messages these are not isolated incidents uh, because uh, this type of lynching are taking place across India and the striking similarity is that the message uh, which is doing the rounds is that child lifters are on the prowl. They are looking for child in that area. So people are detained on suspicion of being child lifters. So this is the message that a group of child lifters are on the prowl looking for children uh, to be picked up uh, is doing rounds across mm -hmm. India. In fact, uh, uh, in the Tripura also it has happened and uh, as you have mentioned, the what the what steps the government or the administration is doing. Uh, the, as I mentioned earlier, one of the men who lost his life was a government driver. He went on a campaign. He was there to spread the message that uh, people should not be misled by such news, such fake news, but he was also linked to that. So definitely there's some strong anti-lynching law has to be pressed here uh, so that this type of incidents can be prevented Absolutely. in the future. Certainly, Arindam Das, thanks for joining in and getting us those inputs there on the story.